Hey guys, it's Jenna. Welcome back to my channel. For this video today, I filmed how I apply a 5x5 lace closure wig that I made from my hair company, snatchbyjanor.com. This is Body Wave Hair, 22 inches, and I'm going to show you guys how I install it, curl it, and yeah. So if you want to know how I got this look, how I do all this, baby hair, all that good stuff, do continue to watch. Do not forget to give this video a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, join the team. Let's get into this look. Let's get snatched by Janor. So this is my wig right here. It looks crazy right now because I blow dried the closure out um, after I bleached the knots and stuff. So like the hair is still body wave, but the closure is kind of straight right now. I just put my makeup on the bottom of it to help blend it in with my skin. And I probably could put just a little more out there. So yeah, this is a 5x5 five five body wave closure. Um, the hair is from my hair company, Snatch by Janor. 22 inches 5x5 five five closure wave. I made it by Swan Machine. I have a video on that on my page. If you just scroll down a little bit, it'll be right there. And also how like, I pluck and bleach the knots on it. So this can be worn glueless, but I think I want to glue it down. I think that's the route I want to go. I'm going to go ahead and clean off my skin. And we're going to get to glue Alright, so I'm just going to do two layers for this video because it's a closure and I don't really need that much glue. I like closures last pretty long. It really just be that your tabs on the front will start be coming up first, so I don't need that many layers. And I'm using my hair by Erica J. Hold me down adhesive. Best hair glue hands down, dries really, really fast. Oops, didn't mean to do that. Alright, so now that that layer is dry, put my second one on. So this one little part right here ain't dry, but we gonna go ahead and do it. Dandy comb and just rub, press that lace on into this glue right here. So yeah, you just want to press the lace into the glue with your comb. And you would normally use <laughs> a blow dryer, but I don't feel like going to get my blow dryer. I think I pressed it enough. And I'm going to take that same eyebrow razor cut down the middle and start shaving off the lace. I'm not really country like that. I don't even know why I'm talking like this, but <laughs> trying to cut off my baby hairs, but I think I'm doing exactly that. I can't do this right here, right now. I don't know. You just see me off this side. I gotta go in the mirror for this side. So now I'm just gonna cut off those little pieces that's left. All right, so look, you see how it's too light? I don't know how to fix it. So since that is done now, I'm going to pull out some baby hair. I'm probably not going to use all this baby hair, but I'm just going to pull some out for the side. And so for the I'm just going to go all the way around. I'm gonna take my hot comb, put some oil on the top of my hair, and like flat iron these flyaways. I mean, hot comb these flyaways. Did I say flyaways? I'm going to hot comb these flyaways. Ooh, y'all, that heat should be 
tingling your damn scalp. Alright, so I'm going to curl my hair. I'm going to do one half on camera and the other half off camera. Just to save time on the video. So it's going to be some loose waves. Nothing too extreme, too tedious. I'm going to take some more of the oil. I'll put on this side of my hair. Brush it through. Take in a decent sized piece of hair. It isn't really, really thick. Like, you know the deal, curls away from my face. Like, I'm talking about y'all know the deal. Do I know the deal? Curls away from my face. And I'm not twisting it. I'm like laying the hair flat. I'm gonna hold it for about 10 seconds. There we go. So now that it's done, I'm gonna do the other side and we're about to see how this all looks. All right, so this side is done. I'm gonna take off this tight tail elastic band supposed to give me a freaking headache. So instead of using mousse, I'm going to use the black dots to detail. Use my little old faithful. And I'm gonna, I feel like these are too big. So things I did, motherfucking fat. Okay. Oh, these are so bomb. And I'm surprised it turned out on camera. Like I can do it a hundred times off camera. As soon as I start recording, like it's like everything goes left. So yeah, look at these curls, y'all. These are fucking cute. I need to watch my mouth up here on this YouTube stuff. If y'all wanna know the real me, she got a potty mouth curls on fleek. And it looks like it has like a natural layered look. So I do love that. 
And like I said, this is a 5x5 closure, not a frontal at all. That will complete this look. Do not forget to give this video a thumbs up. I hope y'all enjoyed this. Because I'm just ID. Subscribe, subscribe, and subscribe, share, comment, all that good stuff. Thanks for watching, y'all. Bye.